What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into uh, Carlissa basically saying that Dre kicked himself out. She said that she got him a million-dollar place, which is probably cap, but she got him a place of his own and uh, paid the rent up to May, and now he claiming he homeless. Let's get it. He laid everything on the line, and I told him, if Dre come for you, we going to have to jump him. If my kids don't want it, I'm about to start passing it out to nephews and cousins and shit. They don't want it. I'm about to retire. <laughs> Well, my man about to retire. You know what that means. We about to retire. <laughs> we about to go on over there where Tasha K sent her son at. <laughs> Get us a, a, a bungalow. <laughs> Child, the way they be talking about each other and their kids is just terrible. And call it a day, honey. My husband got less than 90 days. And this shit about the dock, baby. Y'all let me know if y'all want me to keep going or not. Child, she acting like she about to retire when she just started. You ain't going nowhere. Ain't going well, if not, nowhere. I can retire. Blue and Cali got deals on wheels. I'm good to go. <laughs> I'm, I'm good to sit down. <laughs> but if y'all want me to keep going, I'm going to keep going. She gonna keep going whether they want it or not. Apparently, these these uh mothers who don't raise their children got something to say about me raising mine. I didn't send mine to Africa. Mm -mm, I didn't send them over there to be myself over here. Oh my god! Here, <laughs> I put them to work over here. We work side. Yeah, every time they talk, I just be like, ah. Oh. My chest. My side. Oh, my heart. I, I posted Dre's whole. I, Dre's rent is paid. I don't want to hear nothing about Dre. Dre's rent is paid until May. And if he don't act right come June, he might really be under one of them goddamn benches. <laughs> Y'all know he out there laying on the bench acting like he homeless. You say you need the podcast, Miss. Um, that's what I'm saying. Okay, she said keep going. She said keep going, Carlissa. Cause I'm over here minding my own business, and these people coming over here. Ah. Uh. When you a mother, baby, all you can do is the best what you can do after that. Okay. When they get 30 and they still be talking about my mom ain't do this or. I agree. I agree 100%. My mama need to get off the internet. Nigga, I'm trying. I'm, I'm doing my shit too. You feel me? I'm doing my shit just like they doing they shit. I was, I was in that restaurant minding my own business. Okay, my son summons me when he let that girl put her hands on me. I've been out here ever since. I ain't went nowhere. Cha. I think my podcast is going to be a little different. We're going to be talking about people and setting them straight. The liars and the naysayers, you know, the ones that send their kids over to Africa. When they don't want to be bothered. Again. When she get tough for people like Tasha K, they send lady. their kids to Africa. No, not me. I, I want, took my kids to work with me. I asked my kids. I worked as a stand. For they already saying that she wasn't there. They saying that they. <laughs> why she keeps saying ask her kids when they not on her side? Been on Jeepers Creepers for a whole month. My kids was in the hotel with me for the whole month. Nobody knew they was there. They had a great summer. They'd never forget that shit. I didn't send mine away. Like Jason Lee said, I took mine on my journey with me. Did y'all go watch that Jason Lee interview? Y'all need to go watch that before y'all log onto my podcast talking shit. Because I'm about to start talking shit back to y'all. She did say um, 
everything that she went through, aside from the fact of her leaving Blueface at the hotel when he was a baby for his father. And you know and the this hotel Leo got a lobby shit talking mouth, okay? I will come out of retirement on your ass. I don't want to talk. I want to talk love, but I'm okay with talking. Maybe we took my wig in the house. See, if you would have never took it in the house, they would have never seen it. You trying to play me, man? You over here acting paranoid like Dre? <laughs> trying to play me, man? They said, oh, he grabbed the wig and took the wig in the house. You gotta scroll up some more. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> God damn it, man. No, my son ain't homeless. If he homeless, he choosing to be homeless. My son got a million dollar. He in a million dollar house. Now she kept on a million dollar house. I definitely remember her saying she got him an apartment. I paid the rent till May. Okay. I, I paid it out of his check. So he, cause he can't stay here. Mr. Sappho said you got to get your own. So that's what he don't like about it. That she took it out of his check place. Now you old enough, you grown enough. So I went and took care of it, put him up in a million dollar spot. I don't know if he don't like to be there by himself or what. The boogeyman telling him some shit. I don't know. I don't got nothing to do with that. Your mama ain't never did that for you. Your mama sent you to Africa. Mama sent you to Africa when times got hard. Sure. Dre put up. Dre plays better than mine. He in a better neighborhood than me. If it was a house, then that's crazy. I don't know what I look like in this house. Huh? Man! Come here. Can you open it for me? Sure. Yeah. I continue to react to this stuff because it's in my algorithm. Um, and through these videos, I got to share other videos with y'all. And I think that I'm about to react to something about Diddy. And I'm going to share it in the process. Okay. 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 He told his baby mom not to let you see them kids. You a lie because they pulled up to my house together. Now, I'm going to tell the truth. You Since you're playing, Jaden and John pulled up to my house every other weekend and dropped them kids off and they had a little hideout rendezvous over here at this here hotel okay now i asked them about uh cabazon how about that cabazon Jaden and blue pulled up for babysitters what he didn't want me to do was what he thought i was gonna go live and get some clout i don't go live and get clout if i'm clocked out how about to say cap? <laughs> and if he ever said, "Mom, don't pull if the I'm cameras clocked out," is crazy. Cameras out. I don't pull the cameras out. So they lying. They Jaden and John would pull up to my front door, even when I wasn't speaking to him, together, and drop both them kids off and go have a little rendezvous. Okay. Now, how about that? Tell him I told you that. He don't want me to see the kids. Well, why the? they pulling up here together then dropping them off every other weekend like I was getting visitation rights like I was the daddy child who's again <laughs> I'ma tell y'all this child be a different type of trifling when she want to be y'all listen I have nothing to say about this I'm about to react to um impressive's video and hopefully I think I just cracked my thumb back in the right place um I never got a copyright from her before, but breaking down this whole Diddy thing, like I don't be knowing how to break these videos down like that. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Um, so I am going to react to her video and I'm gonna put the link in this pinned comment when I react to this video. So y'all just look out for the pinned comment and tap in since y'all want me to react to other stuff. I'm in this algorithm, so... Y'all going to have to get with it or get lost, friend. Love y'all. Bye.